Located in a small town called Fumbot, lies a little paradise called Domaine de Pepenon. A very beautiful environment, full of greenery, which has a mixture of uh, the cultural landscape and of civilization. The Domaine de Pepenon is probably one of the most beautiful places currently existing in the West region of Cameroon. On Saturday, the 10th of September 2022, we had the rare privilege to lead some um, 25 other people with us to this beautiful resort which is located in the west region of the country. Full of beautiful smiles and lovely faces, we had to enjoy what this resort offers. Now the first thing that this resort offers was a beautiful lake, very beautiful natural crater lake which if you swim in feels warm at certain points and really cold at other points you know personally for me it was a beautiful experience because i think i have i had not yet swam in a lake before that time and so swimming in a lake was a beautiful experience and seeing how other people get to enjoy swimming in the lake even made it more beautiful now there are some people who did not swim in the lake you know they rather played volleyball now volleyball is one of those sports that i, I mean i'm the, the dude who will not find himself around sports that has to do with ball because you know i have no idea but then these guys played volleyball for more than an hour 30 minutes and the beautiful part about it was that they were playing this volleyball under the rain now i like to state here that pepe Noon has a very very beautiful um environment you know it's so green in there it's really green so much so that you can get lost in what you should do or what you shouldn't do in the place but the beautiful thing is that once you pay your entry ticket to this place you get access to certain activities you know and depending on what you you paid for at the front desk you can get more now pepe Noon offers a couple of activities like swimming they have kayaking they have a boat which can offer you a boat ride can give you the opportunity to have a boat ride through the place they have a bar that sells both local and you know look uh, that sells both homebrew drinks and whiskeys and and all of that they also have a restaurant and above all they have so many rooms of different price standards it's a truly um man-made man-made paradise located totally off grid because going to pepe Noon from the road alone is about one hour 30 minutes using a 4x4 drive you know and there at the pepe Noon resort itself there is not so much um, network coverage and so while you are at pepe Noon, it gives you the off grid experience now if you're somebody who really loves quiet time you really love spending time in nature and you love connecting with yourself in a quiet environment or your people enjoy that kind of environment then maybe taking a weekend to that place will do you so much good now uh, another foresight about the place is that the the roads to the place are not yet tarred it means in the dry season they are going to be a little dusty and in the rainy season they are going to be a little muddy but then it is totally possible with the 4x4 car with motorbikes and yeah you can you can really access the place but once you get to pepe Noon, it's a little beautiful heaven now i would say that another thing they offer is a swimming pool it's rather unfortunate that when we went there they were recycling the water in the pool and so we could not swim but the the resort le domaine de pepe Noon, has a pool that you can you can swim and now if you enjoy hiking if you enjoy hill climbing if you enjoy a bird watching if you enjoy just sightseeing in nature you would also enjoy this resort because it gives you the possibility to do all of these things in the dry season for example the the scenery is so green and beautiful it's so calm and serene you know you can stand at the resort at the explanade of one of one of the corners of the resort and you see cattle and animals literally grazing on the hill and you know the guards they told us that if you come in the dry season birds come around the lake to to drink water even the animals and everything so it's 
it's a it's a beautiful environment as well if you enjoy spending time and doing activities like bed watching and so i'll strongly encourage that you you take yourself there you know we are going to put a couple of moments and pictures that um, our participants we were able to catch of our participants in the place just to give you an idea of what it looks like but you know it's truly a beautiful place and so adventures with big field can help you you know access the place and get there and you know can even be your tour guide to the place all you have to do is contact us using the link in the description and we are going to pick it up from there and do the heavy lifting so that you can have an amazing time remember at adventures with big field what we do is we create content and carry you for trips with the sole intention of helping you discover Cameroon, how beautiful it looks from the inside, offering you opportunities to distress, relax, have fun, meet new people and doing all of that over a plate of food and a bottle of drink. So thank you for watching this video and if you've not yet subscribed to the channel up to this point, please do so, like our Facebook page, share this video with somebody who would like it and see you in the next one.